You there. Why are you so late? Why have you kept me waiting so long? In here. I just put my car in the garage. I had a blowout. I thought maybe this... Go on in. Look, maybe I better take my car and get it off. Wipe your feet. Go on. You're not uh, properly dressed for the occasion. What's the occasion? Have him come up, Matt. Up the stairs. Suppose you listen to me for just a minute. Madame is waiting. For me? Okay. Do you need any help with the coffin? Call me. massage table in front of the fire. He always liked fires and poking at them with a stick. I've made up my mind we'll bury him in the garden. Any city laws against that? I wouldn't know. I don't care anyway. I want the coffin to be white and I want it specially lined with satin. White or deep pink. Maybe red, bright flaming red. Let's make it gay. How much will it be? I warn you, don't give me a fancy price just because I'm rich. Lady, you got the wrong man. I had some trouble with my car, a flat tire. I pulled into your garage until I could get a spare. I thought this was an empty house. It is not. Get out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you lost your friend. And I don't think red is the right color. Wait a minute. Haven't I seen you before? I know your face. Get out, or shall I call my servant? You're Norma Desmond. Used to be in silent pictures. Used to be big. I am big. It's the pictures that got small. I knew there was something wrong. They're dead. They're finished. There was a time in this business when they had the eyes of the whole wide world. But that wasn't good enough for them. Oh, no. They had to have the ears of the world, too. So they opened their big mouths, and out came talk. Talk, talk. That's where the popcorn business comes in. You buy yourself a bag and plug up your ears. Look at them in the front offices. The masterminds. They took the idols and smashed them. The Fairbanks is the Gilberts, the Valentinos. And who have we got now? Some nobody. Don't blame me. I, I'm not an executive, just a writer. You are writing words, words, more words. Well, you've made a rope of words and strangled this business. <laughs> but there's a microphone right there to catch the last gurgles. And Technicolor to photograph the red swollen tongue. You'll wake up the monkey. Get out! Max! Next time I'll bring my autograph album along. Or maybe a hunk of cement and ask for your footprint. It's okay, okay, I'm going. Just a minute, you. You're a writer, you said. Why? Are you or aren't?